the neighborhood pool is an oasis on a hot summer day. But what about the after effects? The chlorine smell on your skin, in your hair. The pool goes home with you. But what if there was a way to cut down on all that chlorine and the smell? With moss. And this technology developed out of my work in wound healing. And people have treated wounds with moss for centuries. And we found out that moss has a number of different act activities that allow us to treat water with less chemicals. Turns out sphagnum moss is a natural for pool filtration. Moss works side by side with chemicals and reduces the need for them. Now St. Paul swimmers are reaping the benefits. We are the very first facility internationally that is doing this. It's been done in residential pools and they had gotten it, the science down to residential pools and hot tubs and home filtration systems. But what they didn't have any experience was large bodies of water. Automatically right away we started seeing the water work and the water slightly changing in its color, although it has a very pretty blue but I can feel the difference, and it took me about three weeks to feel that difference in the water. One man's experiment with moss has become an industry standard. And so I was doing research with this on wound healing, and I decided to put it in my spa, and just to see what it would work. And within a week, the spa was clean and clear and didn't stink anymore. So this was done in a large laboratory, but the water thing actually started in my spa in my home. Swimmers at Highland Pool and now Great River Water Park may not care about sphagnum moss. They just love the water. Right away, within the first couple weeks, people started coming up to me and saying, the water quality is so awesome this year. Thank you so much, Lynn. And, I mean, it's just phenomenal. I mean, it's been a pleasure to watch all of these people enjoy the water so much more. Experience the difference yourself at the Highland Park Aquatic Center or Great River Water Park. Go to stpaul.gov slash parks and click on aquatics for locations and hours.